warm hello in every sense of the word. The sun is out and football has a special place on this most idyllic of days. A fixture ahead of us to which we've all been looking forward for so very, very long and it means so very, very much. The scene could not be more beautiful. The pitch looks terrific. The players are ready to get started and we cannot wait for a contest that lies ahead. Well, this really is a great venue. It adds so much character to every game it stages. Two high-profile, high-caliber teams. This is a welcome event for all these supporters. Oh, get ready for some high-grade football, Peter. Two strong teams, as you say, full of wonderful individual talent. And we have every right to anticipate some really entertaining football. As to whether we'll see a high-scoring contest, that's a little harder to predict. I'm not complaining, though, because... They're... It's Lewandowski! Looking back on that, it was some save and potentially a big moment for the keeper and this team. He's in! He's had a shot! Goal! Poland! And it's Poland who take the lead! What a great finish, but how about the touch? It just allowed him to put the ball exactly where he wanted it, and the rest became a formality. Doubt very much that this was in the script. Meunier. Meunier puts his foot on the gas. Mertens. And here's Lukaku. Plenty of appeals, but the referee is not interested. That's just very well played. He can't hurt you with his back to go, and he didn't go for the back here. Bednarek, forward it goes. And here's Lewandowski, chance! They've scored! And they're at it again in double quick time. Poland are certainly a team that knows how to play their football as stylishly as you'll see. Tiki Taka at its very best and they back it up with goals. Made it two, and no doubt he's hungry for more. <laughs> Poland have a couple of goals without reply, it's 2-0. Well, they're very much the better team at the moment, Peter, and, and no doubt we'll be looking to, to cause even more damage here. Click. Zielinski. Plays it out to the flank. Some good work on the right flank. Now, what's next? Zielinski. Good take, and he's had a look. He's good for it. Knocks it away. 
Lukaku. Walk forward. What does he try from here? Carrasco. More than happy to take the muscular approach. That's one way of trying to make things happen. There's a few who could follow that example. Belgium are still behind as we reach out for half-time. And it's Murnian. Nothing but a skill there. Mertens. Ferreira Carrasco! Oh, that is very close. Yeah, the shot was enabled people due to such smart control and technique. Zielinski. Well positioned to make that interception. That's the whistle for half time. The opinion you'd like to express on the first half? Look, Peter, this isn't good. Their body language is not encouraging, and the manager must have a, a major verbal impact, or else. Again, then. Well, this half might require them to produce a plan A, B, and C. Leveling the score is easier said than done, but that would be the target. Get back on terms and then use that momentum to go again. Then Tonka. De Bruyne. Gorgeous control there. That intervention was very necessary. And it's Murnia. De Bruyne. Then Tonka. Tielemans. And here's Carrasco. Tielemans is fouled. And it's Lukaku. Mournier is on the end of some really unwanted attention. Well, there's certainly a, a coordinated attempt to shut him down, which is, I suppose, a natural response. Oh, the ball needed to be better there, it's a wasted chance. Hold the ball. Torgan Azar pushes to get on the end of it. Carrasco. Poland look very much like they've got to that time where it's all about closing this one out. Just take the sting out of the opposition. Unlike their opponents who have to do precisely the opposite, and time is running out on them. Let's wrestle off the ball. Whistle's gone, that's a foul. Well, you might think he got off lightly. It is just a verbal warning. Defence got the better of him this time, but I'm sure he'll go again. Can't get the better of his opposite number. Torgan Azar drives it forward. <laughs> the 
Ahmet Darak. Tries to get it forward quickly. A good challenge, stood up well against his man. And it's Azar. That is very well defended. Just brushed off the ball there. Then Donka. Tielemans. Hazard. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Goes for goal! That's a real chance missed. Oh, it's so very disappointing, but they can't dwell on it. They've got to go again. Simple as. So here comes the substitution. Talking as played it short. De Bruyne gets up to him. Just one in it now. The game takes on a whole new complexion. An absolute gem of a cross. They made the header simple. Oh, look, it's, it's often the timing of the jump that dictates what you can do with any header. And if you get it slightly wrong, then you struggle. But it was beautifully met the Bruyne was. Belgium get themselves back into contention. Well, they've given themselves a chance here, but now it's a case of getting the balance right between attack and defence, and that's not easy. That could spell trouble. Bednarek. Hoist it forward. Zielinski. Poland certainly don't need to overcommit now. Their priority lies further back. Talking as a two minutes to be added on. And here's Azar. Talking as a Now it's Hazard. Hazard. Hazard with the delivery. It's anyone's ball. And that is it. The equaliser just wouldn't come. It is over. Belgium played a big part in it, but they walk away with nothing.